Lawmakers were in Springfield today. They had a special one-day voting session. They weren't alone. Our Ed Cross in Springfield with how protesters interrupted that session today. Ed? Well, Sean, today's protest started during the scheduled Revenue Committee meeting this morning. And protesters spoke out against a bill which House lawmakers passed giving tax incentives to companies like Sears and the Chicago Mercantile Exchange. They say the state is taking money away from education and service providers and giving it to big business. As Illinois faces an unprecedented budget crisis, college students, as well as education in general, are being hit with devastating cuts to vital programs and resources. Yet the Illinois legislature is considering a tax break for the Chicago Mercantile Exchange Group. It makes me angry that programs so important for struggling people are being cut and big banks and corporations like Chicago Mercantile Exchange are not doing their fair share. From there, the protests continue to the House chambers where members of Occupy Springfield rolled out a large banner before they were kicked out. When asked if they plan to return to tomorrow's Senate's one-day session, protesters say an appearance might be possible. So we'll see what happens. At the Capitol, I'm Ed Cross reporting your local news on WAND Storm Center 17. Sean, back to you.